In this quick video, you'll learn how to replace the internal battery in your Chevy Monte Carlo key fob. Now, some of you out there might have a device that looks similar to this, but it has a fourth button. It's like a red panic button that lives right there. Um, and then there's another version that looks exactly like mine, but instead of this icon of the car with the trunk open, it says rear 2X. Uh, it doesn't matter which version you have. There are just a couple layouts of this particular uh, Monte Carlo key fob, and they all take the same battery and the process to open them up is the same. So you can just follow along with me here and I promise we'll get a new battery in your device in under five minutes. Uh, the only things you'll need to get this done is a regular coin and one CR2032 battery. If you don't have one of those lying around, you can go check the link in the description that will take you over to Amazon where you can find this particular battery for just a few dollars. The first step here is just to look on the bottom right of the device, right next to where the key ring attaches. You can see there's a large opening, kind of a slot there, right along the seam in the plastic. Take your coin, insert it in there, and then just twist the coin. And with very little force, this thing will crack right open. And you can now put that to the side and come over here to work on the battery. Um, if you have longer fingernails, you can now just get under the battery and pull it right out. Otherwise, I suggest grabbing something like a flathead screwdriver, even a pen or pencil or another key will work. What we want to do is come over to this little section, kind of an indentation there. And uh, that's going to help us to get under the battery. And just push it up or pry it up. So you're just finding that little opening, getting under the battery. And lifting it up. Go ahead and dispose of your old battery, grab your new CR2032 battery, and when you're putting it in, you want to make sure that the positive side that has the plus on it is facing down. So you'll just line it up in this little circular area in the plastic, snap it in there with the positive side facing down. And all we need to do now is just click these two halves back together. So just line it up and snap them back together. And with that, you are finished. You've got a new battery in there and you are good to go. I hope that was helpful for you. And if it was, you can let me know down in the comments or just by giving this video a like. And if you ever need help with another one of your devices, you can come back here. We've got you covered with videos for the key fobs from almost every maker model out there. And you can also get that information over at our website, fobbattery.com.